Hey, Louvran, and welcome back once again to Unity of Command 2. We're playing the Desert Rats DLC. And we're here with the next mission, the Battle of Karen. March 15th, 1941. Basically cut off from reinforcements and resupply. The Italian army in East Africa had to pick its battlefields with great care. As Commonwealth forces advanced towards Asmara and Massawa, one such location was Karen. This otherwise unassuming town sits on the strategically vital and only rail line leading into the heartland of Italian Eritrea. Furthermore, the town's surroundings offered excellent defensive positions in the form of forts and harsh mountainous terrain. Luckily those uh, hopefully won't stop me from doing whatever is necessary. As expected, the Italians have opted to make a stand in and around Karen. The town and its surroundings make for a very imposing obstacle indeed. Think rugged granite peaks with little to no cover for advancing troops. In blistering heat, your orders are to clear as many of the surrounding mountains as possible before launching an assault on Karen itself. Once you break through, utilize your superior mobility and drive hard and fast for Asmara. I think my sound is a bit too high, but I guess I'll fix that up later. Um, let's do this first. Now, you're already fine. I think I'm going to give you Gurkhas for now. Then... Let's look at the terrain. Yeah. Do I want to spend another 110? Eh, guess I will. I mean, uh, I'm sure it's better this way. One, two, three, four, five. Move this. All right, we have Mount Umba turn two. FT, I don't know what this FT is for. Dologorogok. Mount Falesto, Mount Samana. All of these mountains are turn two. Masawa turn six and hold. That's here. Esmara is five and Karen is four. Mm, so I suppose I'll take two of those mountains in the first turn and two of them on the second. Or I'll try. No, that gives me Blenheim. Uh, then I want to take this. HQ upgrade is not that important here, since we'll not get it back anyway. I'll go for the free option. Um, move you in here. I cannot get on to the mountain now. Uh, I don't see them moving in there, but... Let's uh, move you forward anyway. Did lose counterattack and feint attack. But I don't really care.
Sweet. Okay. They have not moved, um, but neither have these. It was pretty expensive to do this, but ultimately that did work. <clears throat> it's a bit stuffy in here, but apparently this is empty too. That should make my life a lot easier. Well, let's turn four. units and it will be out of supply should have only did do one but um, at least I got the specialist step <clears throat> Wow, really? Ugh. Even worse right now. I need to do that. I mean, yeah, you'll be back. Let's give them the engineers. Okay, um, these two can now no longer attack. This Mara has turned five, so I better. Start working on it. Hmm. 
they can go in there potentially. No longer cut off my unit. I think I just hold that for now. Rather attack these so it'll be easier to take on the next turn. I'm not attacking that. Yeah, I'll take myself on the next turn, it'll be fine. <clears throat> Is that a hold as well? Let's go for the free one here. But I do like the free experience on the Indian Brigade at least. Yeah, these guys will be there more. Should have used them. Uh, yeah. Just taking supplies here. <clears throat> huh, well. Right, there is uh, nothing that can be done now. I right, just wanted to get those last few things. And that's it. With gratitude of an empire, win the Battle of Karen. The whole empire has been stirred by the achievement of the Indian force in Eritrea. Wrote Winston Churchill to the Viceroy of India shortly after victory at Karen. Throughout World War II, Indian troops were such a vital part of the British war effort. It is hard to imagine Britain victorious without them. In light of this, the post-war British effort to stop Indian independence seems all the more shameful. We lost one special step, but that's about it. Alright, that was the Battle of Karen, and I would say that, you know, my endeavors in East Africa are now over, but we'll only get to see that after those disasters. Um, yeah. Next up will be Disaster in Cyrenaica. Uh, thanks for watching for now. Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please consider leaving a like, comment, or subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Take care. See you then. Bye-bye.